hey guys what's up welcome back to another video so in this video i'm going to show you how to download and install mysql server into your macbook m1 so for that just open your favorite browser and search for mysql server download so just click on download and just click on this first link from dev.mysql.com and down here you will be able to see this option of downloading for mac os 11 so just click on download so let me just click on no thanks so this will download the community version for mysql server so let me just click on download and save so once this dmg file is downloaded let me just show in finder and just double click to install so let me just double click this one so this will automatically start installing the mysql server so let me just click on this package and let me just click on allow and click continue and install and enter your password and click on next so here you just need to give one password and it should contain at least eight character and mix of letter number and other character so let me just click on finish and enter the password of your mac so the installation is successful so let me just click on close and let me just move this installer into the trash so let me just close this one and let me close everything from here so once you do that let me just go to the system preferences from here so just click on system preferences and down here you will be able to see this option of mysql here so so you can see here the mysql server is already running here so if you want to start mysql whenever your computer is start off so you can just tick here and enter your password so that it will run every time so once you successfully install the mysql server so you just need to configure your path as well so for that just open the spotlight search and search for terminal and if you just type ls hyphen a so here you will be able to see dot bash underscore profile so if you are not able to see dot bash profile so you just need to type touch dot bash underscore profile so just type enter and if i again type ls hyphen a so you can see the dot bash underscore profile has been created so once you create that just type open hyphen t dot bash underscore profile so inside here you just need to copy the path of mysql so for that just open spotlight search again and just type slash usr and just go into this location here folder location and inside here you just need to go into this local and inside here you just go inside mysql and just right click into this win and press an option of your keyboard and copy the bin as path name so once you do that let me just again go here into the bash profile so let me just close this one and just type export so the export should be in a small letter and just type path in capital letter equals to dollar and just type path again and column and just type command and v to paste that path and let me just type command and s to save this vast profile and close here and also let me just close and quit this terminal so again let me just open my terminal by just going into this spotlight search and if i just type mysql hyphen u root hyphen p so this will ask us to enter the password so this is the password which we have just set while installing the mysql server so let me just type that password so here if i just type so databases so these are the databases given by the system so if i want to create a new database just type create database so let me just call it hello and enter so if i just type so databases here so you can see the hello database has been created so now you can perform all the mysql operation so this is how you install mysql server into your macbook m1 thank you so much for watching don't forget to like share and subscribe to my channel